Saint Bede the Venerable, also known as the Venerable Bede, was a renowned English monk, historian, theologian, and scholar of the early Middle Ages. Born around 672 or 673 AD in the region now known as Sunderland, England, Bede spent the majority of his life at the monastery of St. Peter and St. Paul in Jarrow. From a young age, Bede displayed a remarkable aptitude for learning, and he dedicated his life to scholarship and the pursuit of knowledge. He delved into various subjects such as grammar, rhetoric, mathematics, music, and astronomy, but his primary passion was theology and the study of scriptures. Bede's most significant contribution to history and scholarship was his masterpiece, Ecclesiastical History of the English People. Completed around 731 AD, this work became a foundational source for understanding the early history of Britain and the spread of Christianity in the region. Bede's meticulous research, attention to detail, and objective approach earned him the title Father of English History. Apart from his historical writings, Bede composed numerous theological and exegetical works, demonstrating his profound understanding of biblical texts and religious matters. His devotion to his faith was evident in his daily life as he adhered to monastic rules and led a life of simplicity, humility, and prayer. Despite his immense scholarship and reputation, Bede remained a humble and dedicated servant of God. He was renowned for his kindness, wisdom, and generosity, attracting students and visitors from far and wide who sought to benefit from his knowledge. St. Bede passed away on May 25, 735 AD, and his death was mourned by many. His contributions to scholarship, theology, and the spread of Christianity continue to inspire and influence generations of scholars and faithful followers to this day. Canonized as a saint in 1899, St. Bede the Venerable's legacy endures as a beacon of intellectual pursuit, devotion, and piety in the Christian tradition. His life and works serve as a reminder of the profound impact that a dedicated scholar and faithful servant of God can have on the world.